I'm sure you're wondering, transformed cause of Cain's age, what's that all about? Well, remember my video last week showed you how to make the flowered beaded halo crown on the left? We'll drop the link in the description. Now, the client says it's not suitable for someone over 70 years, and so I had to do some transformation. Here is how the transformation went. I cut out shining pulley 10 by 36 and followed the crunches method. Please check the link for a video on how to make the crunches below. And then I squeezed it like so. And I started stirring it starting from where the flowers began. Now what you do is take a matching thread and your needle and you're going to pass it through the um, crunches and take it through the flower you understand to hold it and take it back now from the front remember to take it through close to the flower in fact everything is close close just that you pass it in and keep going but you get to know how to do that so what i did also after i sold the little part of that first time i now sold the other edge too from that flower side because i wanted it from one flower to the next so you saw that part just the same way just a small part keep watching and learning okay now i went back to where i started before now i'm going to be pleating it as i'm sewing so it gets more full so that's the idea of sewing one side first then you sew the other side to get the limit of where you want it to be and then you start pleating as you go around along and sewing so i'll just then um, keep what meanwhile don't let anybody hear i actually woke up late in the night to do this so i was still in my 90s but i needed to do it and i said i should actually show you how that was done so please do forgive me i'm in my night when i couldn't start changing no but i needed to get it done because it was something that was just too i was just told urgently or quickly or how would i put it to make the changes So while you're watching how I sold it all the way around, don't forget that if you can't find any of the items used in your local store, you can check my Amazon or AliExpress links in the description below. I also have my own link there too. And if you have gained value from this video so far, do give me a thumbs up. And if you haven't subscribed to this great beautiful channel, please click the subscribe button. Okay, we're off to the next stage and this our beaded hollow crown. Alright, so the next thing I did was to stone it with rhinestones to, you know, beef up the beauty. So, while we have it, remember that after you subscribe, you need to click the bell for notifications so you keep getting my, oh, getting not notified of my, of the new videos that I uploaded. And also, if you didn't join in the free hot wire training, you can still get it. All you need to do is click on the link for the Venn Craft Academy reception in the description below and make a request for the free hat wire class. You don't, you really do want to join up in that. Now, that's how I created and made it to be for a 70 year old. So what do you think? Is it now for a 70 year old or not? Now back to our game challenge for last week. Who won it? It is Deborah Azike. Congratulations. Please do contact us in the Ventcraft Academy. The link is below and collect your prize. Yes, you want to attend Fascinator Class 1 for free. Now the challenge for today. What is the name of the video that we made first of all before this video? Whoever gets it, you get to attend Fascinator Class 2 for free. Really? You need to really check this next video up over here and watch it for more.